10 freaking years ago today. That guy. That guy with the good chin. With the good chin. Wearing the bat cow. 10 years ago today, guys. Ben Affleck was announced as Batman. Batman versus Superman. What? 10 years ago. That's blowing my mind. Blowing my mind. And it's funny, too, because when I think about... I, I could tell you, and I've, I've, I've said this before, but I'm going to talk about it again. I remember when it was announced. I remember seeing the tweet. Like I remember having my phone and seeing the tweet and it being announced that Ben Affleck was going to be playing Batman. I remember, obviously, when Batman vs. Superman got announced at Comic-Con so beautifully, Harry Lennox, the way that they did it in Hall H was so beautiful, just, ah, just so great, that everybody was like, who's going to be playing Batman? Who's going to be playing Batman? And I even did, like, a top five. I can't even remember my top five, but what's funny enough is my, I think my, my first choice was actually Joe Meganello, <laughs> who ended up, you know, being Deathstroke. But I was like... I thought he would be actually a pretty good Batman, but 10 years ago, 10 years ago today. And I remember I was at my mom's house. I think it was a Sunday. If I'm not, it had to be a Sunday because I, I was doing, uh, this is when I lived really close to her. And of course, naturally you live close to your mom. You don't have a washer or a dryer. So you go to your mom's to do laundry. And that's what I did. I went to, uh, I, I would go to her house like every Sunday and we'd have dinner and I'd do my laundry. So maybe we weren't living. I don't know. That's, that's, you know, that's semantics right there. But I remember seeing that and just kind of going like, what? Ben Affleck? You can go see, you, you can, you can go back into my videos. What the F? I can't even fathom this right now. Ben Affleck. Ben freaking Affleck. Ugh. I, oh my Lord. He's totally not on my list. Totally wasn't even, I mean, I remember hearing he was rumored. Uh, a couple times, and I was like, no, they wouldn't choose Batman. Holy, why would they do that? Why don't they do what they did? And I was not on board at first. That's what's crazy. I was not on board when it came to Ben Affleck being cast as Batman. I was not on board. I was like, holy crap. That's not who, I was like, huh, really? Ben Affleck? But then I slowly, as I saw people make concept art, you know, I went, oh, okay, I could see this. Yeah, I could totally. But yeah, you can go back and see my reaction. It's I, I was not I was not about it at first, but you know, but now guess what happened? He's my favorite cin cinematic Batman of all time. You know, I mean, we'll see. I was like, all right, is uh, Robert Pattinson going to end up taking the taking the pedestal? No, nah, but he's still up there. I think Robert Pattinson did a great job. Didn't beat out Batfleck. Now we have another Batman that's going to be supposedly coming in, which we're going to be talking about somebody who was rumored to be putting on that cape and cow, which is very interesting. And uh, do I hope that it maybe he will take the podium? Yes. I always root for the newest thing to be the best thing. I'm not one of those like, oh yeah, I'll never be, I'll, I'll never, I, I'm not one of those that'll be like, yeah, it'll never be topped. It'll never, this is where now it'll never be topped. I'm like, no. I hope it gets topped. I want, that's the thing about this whole thing. It's like, it's all about competition. Make it better than the last one. That's what I hope for. 